So have you ever been in this situation when you're training, you're going against a higher level guy, somebody that's a little bit more fit than you, maybe he's bigger, a little bit stronger, and he's really pushing the pace, you're doing your best to recover guard, and they're about to pass your guard, and instead of doing the right thing, which would be maybe accept the pass, but have good defense and side control, you turtle up, and you give up your back, and things go from bad to worse, and you stay there. And the truth is, like, you can't really hide on the mat. So your training partner knows what happened. You know what happened. You just you got tired, and you kind of gave up. And here's the problem, though. That's a slippery slope. If you do that once, twice, three times, that becomes, like, your, your go-to setting, all right? And you're never going to get over the hump. And what's the hump? The hump is, like, that, that burning awful feeling in your chest when your legs are done you're you're you know breathing so heavy and you're getting claustrophobic and you feel awful we've all been there usually it's like when you're coming back from vacation but if you don't embrace that and push through that like you're never going to get to the other side you're always going to butt up against that and then do the wrong thing you're going to fold so you got to get over the hump and the other thing is this against a higher level person you're always going to kind of be more reserved and it's actually like being reserved that puts you in a worse spot. All right. So the advice is this. Go after the higher rank. Yes, you're going to get caught dozens and dozens of times. Then you're going to start blocking that, that attack that they're going to hit you with. And they're going to go to something else. But every single time you go into the fray, you're going to learn how to navigate. That's also getting over the hump. All right, so the more you kind of shell up and try to like just protect yourself and avoid all those uncomfortable and maybe dangerous positions – the more you're hindering your own growth. Like you got to go out there. You got to put yourself out there. And by putting yourself out there, I mean get into those exchanges with a higher level where you're going to get caught, but you're going to learn. Put yourself out there by embracing those scrambles, even though you're going to end up in a bad spot and you're going to be exhausted, stuck on bottom. You got to get over that hump. It's the only way that eventually you'll win that scramble. So embrace it.